Hello, everybody. What's up, YouTube? NASCAR fans slash TakeOver Gaming here. Today, it's 2017 NASCAR Authentics Wave 2. Let's get into it. So, the first car we're going to get into reviewing is the Ford Bush car. Now, this car should be on a stand, be, stand, but you can unscrew it. Viewer description is advised for two of these cars because they have beer logos on it. So, parent regarding... Parent... Uh, I need... Parents should, should at least stand by be watching so just because this is a beer card so anyways unless you well unless you're 18 or older so the so this car is a nice car to add to a collection it's definitely one that you won't be seeing often you won't see next year because I only saw one, and I ended up getting it where I found it at Indianapolis, which is actually my new my new thing. Yeah, I, I tried to make Indianapolis. So, anyways, a very nice car to add to your collection, and one that just goes. Sort that goes with this one will be shown later. On to the next one. So the next car is the Dale Earnhardt Jr. Exalted, and I'm pretty sure this car was already in one of the waves. So yeah, a nice car. You know, it reminds me of a sunset, kinda, a sunset. Maybe that's what their goal was for it to look like a sunset. A nice car. And if you're a Dale Jr. fan, you'll want to pick this one up before they're gone. They're probably already gone. On to the next. Oh, well, then pause again. Okay, so apparently we have pausing issues, but the next car, or the third car out of the eight, is the Tony Stewart Bass Pro Shop car. A very nice car. It was his primary car. But unless you're like a big Tony Stewart fan, I wouldn't pick this up because it's it's not the best car. It's not one of my favorites like every other car in the wave, but in this fantasy wave. But I I I I still liked it enough to pick it up. There have been a lot of cars that I just didn't like that. I didn't pick up, but I like this one getting just enough that I'd want to pick it up. So, you know, it's what you want to add to your collection. You know? Anyway. So, the fourth car we're, ha we're going to, we're almost halfway through, is the Joey Logano Pennzoil. Probably my favorite car in this wave. Man, when I saw this, I was like, we're... The money I have, I'm going to get it. So, you know, we picked it up, and it's in this wave now, wave two. So, focus. Well, it's not going to focus, obviously. But, um, man, this is a really nice paint scheme. I recommend, for if you're going to begin collecting, this is the one I'd recommend starting your collection off with. Or, if you already have a collection, definitely pick it up. Okay. So, at the end of the video, I usually have where I set every car in a pack. Now, the, now the Joey Logano and the Matt Kenseth are going to be together like they're wrecking each other. Just for laughs. Giggles and laughs. Because, we all know 2015 at Martinsville, don't we? Yeah. Anyways, his primary car, you know, not not too bad. 
but you know it's not it's not like the Joey Logano. These two will probably end up wrecking each other soon. Don't drive away from me. Anyways, on to his teammate, Denny Hamlin. Guys, it didn't pause. Anyways, the 11 of Denny Hamlin in his FedEx Freight. Yeah, it's a little bit darker than the orange. Let me show you the difference. Okay, here's the difference. This is the Freight one. This is the regular. See the difference? Yeah, one's a bit darker. Yeah, I just wanted to show you that. I've made that mistake on a car. I wanted to get like I was looking for for a while and I missed it completely because of that. I was like, oh my gosh. My my dream is done. And I still don't have it to this day. A nice car. Dad to your collection. So car number seven is the Jimmy Johnson primary. The car he won his champion his seventh championship. Ooh, you know, that's... Or do the Polish lap. Anyways, a nice car. Probably my favorite primary ever, ever made. Nice car, and we're going to go on to the final car. And the, a Kevin Harvick. So, I have the light, and this one should have a stand. So, again, parent needs to watch this last bit anyways um i want you to see the difference so this was the first car revealed or er, reviewed the last car I reviewed so you no know. anyways a nice car i like this one better than that one so of course i'm gonna say it at, this is one you'll want to add to your collection. And Lino did not sponsor this video. Just so you know if you are questioning that. Okay, so if you... So like, subscribe, and comment. And let me know what your favorite car in this wave was. Bye, guys, and thank you for watching.